So what is more natural than just using motion? It's using eyes and motion. We use our eyes to locate, to gather information, to precisely identify what we want to interact with. Then we use our bodies to interact with it and to control. That's a natural interface. So we've done that in putting together a couple demos. In this case, this is a heads up display where we use an eye tracker to track the eyes and we use either a touch interface or a touchless interface to be able to control the different facets of the heads up display. The other unique thing about it is you don't have to look at it while you control it. You look at it, you can look back at the road and then you confirm what it is you want with a body motion. So I can look at what I want, look back at the road and control it with my hand or my thumb or a body motion while I'm driving. I could also control it just with my eyes or just with my body. So we built in multiple redundancies. You have multiple different ways of doing the same thing as well. So I can use a swipe, I can use a motion to scroll up and down variably, or I can look at a plus or minus key and I can tap, tap, tap. All of these ways combine together to allow the user to interact the way they want to. We can also integrate audio controls to build in even more redundancies and make it even a more pleasing user interface.